Life as we know it. Scientists used to think that all life on Earth needed light to survive. But then, scientists discovered that life exists here, too, in the deep, dark ocean, far below the surface of the sea. First, they found animals living near underwater volcanoes called black smokers. Now, they've discovered life in an even more extraordinary place. They call it Lost City. The Lost City is in the North Atlantic Ocean, in a huge group of undersea mountains. These scientists are preparing a robot called Hercules to explore Lost City. National Geographic explorer Bob Ballard says exploring Lost City is like going into outer space. What it's amazing to me is that we didn't go into the largest feature on Earth until after Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin went to the moon. In fact, now we have better maps of Mars than we have of the deep sea beneath the waves. It's amazing. Here, the seawater is extremely hot. But somehow, many creatures seem to thrive here. The scientists didn't expect to find any animals here. It's 200 degrees Celsius, hotter than boiling water, and the water is filled with chemicals that can kill life. The scientists use robots that they can control from the surface. These robots collect and bring up creatures that live in Lost City so the scientists can study them. They believe these animals may survive here because there are a lot of tiny creatures called microbes for them to eat. The existence of places like this on Earth makes Ballard and other scientists wonder. Could places like Lost City exist on other planets? Ballard thinks it's possible. What we're discovering is that uh, life is much more creative than we ever thought it was. And there'll be many other expeditions, not only on our planet looking for exotic life forms living in extreme environments, but in outer space itself. Meanwhile, scientists will continue to study Lost City, trying to discover what other secrets it can tell us about life, how it started, and where we can find it.